Topstep is one of the oldest trading prop firms out. They've been around forever, I swear. Um, they're one of the first prop firms that I actually heard of and looked into. And uh, I have a lot of experience trading on Topstep. So I'm going to be breaking down everything there is to know about Topstep. That way you can make the best decision on whether Topstep is something for you. I'm going to tell you what I like, what I don't like, what their account rules are, and just everything other than the side about Topstep. So let's get right into it. So we're over here on topstep.com and one of the first things that you love to see from any prop firm is the fact that they're paying people out. So Topstep has paid out over $23 million since 2020. Uh, since March of 2024, they've given out 20,093 funded accounts. They recently, uh, as of like last year, just changed it to where you can get a funded account within two days. And then they've been around, like I said in the intro, forever, over 12 plus years of experience uh, in the proper game. So they've been around for a long time and they're probably not going anywhere anytime soon. Uh, so yeah, really good things when you first start to kick off on a website, just seeing some things that they boast. TopSip offers the same account size that pretty much every other prop firm offers. So they give you the 50K account, they give you a 100K account, and then a 150K account. Now, what's funny is that their monthly prices basically uh, matches the amount of buying power that you get. So for uh, 50 bucks a month, when you're just trading in the prop or, or in the eval stage, it's $50 a month for the 50K account. It's $100 a month for the 100 account, 100K account. And then it's $150 a month for the 150K account. And then you have your profit target. Again, this matches up with pretty much every single other prop firm. 3000 for the 50 6,000 for the 100 and 150, it's nine grand to pass the eval stage. And then the maximum position size, this is where they change up a little bit. So it's five contracts that you get for a 50K account. It's 10 for the 100 account and it's 15 for the 150K account. Now with these comes the part that I do not like about top step. So five contracts is five contracts, whether you're playing five minis or five micros it's five contracts they don't do the um the the matching between minis to micros like most other prop firms do where if you're in you know one mini you can also trade the 10 micros instead it's just five contracts is five contracts regardless of what size it is right and we'll talk about that a little bit more uh later but that's something that is kind of a knock for me against top step now, the uh, maximum loss limit is $2,000 for the 50K, it's $3,000 for the 100K, and then it's $4,500 for the 150K account. And that's basically your true amount of money that you have in the account. Again, there's some extra stipulations there that we'll talk about a little bit later, but um, that is the maximum amount of money that you can lose before you have to reset your account. Once you pass the eval account, then they put you in an express funded account and you only have to pay a $150 activation fee. It's one time and it's for all the account sizes. So this is something that I actually do like, especially for the larger accounts, right? Because if we look at, at a, a prop from like Apex, you're paying 160 bucks for the 50K account, where here you're paying 150 for the 50K account and then you're paying 150 for the 100K and the 150K, where in apex for the 100k and the 150k you're actually paying more i don't remember the exact prices for those but i do know that they're more than 150 dollars. so uh top step gets the win there when it comes to the activation fee you're actually kind of saving money um but they don't offer a monthly they only offer just a one-time pay once you pay the 149 basically 150 you activate your express funded and then you're good to go no matter what account size you have if you do end up blowing your account then you can reset it right after it's been blown. So uh, for a 50K account, the reset's gonna be 50 bucks. It's the same size as the accounts. Uh, 100K is gonna be 100, and then the 150K is gonna be 150. But if you don't wanna reset it right away, you can just wait until the rebuild cycle happens. So whenever you pay for the account, you get rebuild at the end of, or at the end of a month, basically. Um, and that rebuild will reset the account. So. Uh, if you don't want to pay any extra, but you still want to keep the account, just wait till the next month. And once you get rebuilt, it'll automatically reset the account as well. Another thing that I really like about Top Step is that 
Topstep does a ton of giveaways on their Topstep TV. Uh, it's just the, the YouTube channel. You can look it up. Um, and a lot of times they will give away free resets if you just wait long enough. Um, they will give free resets during their fire drills or doing the uh, top step quizzes on the actual show. Um, and that way you can get free resets. Uh, also, if you sign up for their newsletter, they'll have, you know, the news, they'll have promos and their holiday deals. So definitely something you might want to look into. Uh, but the other thing about Top Step that I, I really like is that if something goes wrong with any of their accounts, like if if there was a problem and they know about it, they will give you a free reset or they'll reset your account back to its previous, um, like the, 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 the state of the account previous to whatever error occurred. So they are really, really good as far as their customer service. And they're really, really good about, you know, giving resets when resets are actually uh, necessary because the trader got screwed over for whatever reason. Just to give a quick example, um, they were having a problem with resetting the account at the rebuild for the Tops of X. And because of that, they actually gave out free resets to everybody with the Tops of X account. So um, they will give out free resets when uh, warranted. And that's something I really like about Tops of They really are for the trader when it comes to just the little things. When you're ready to actually get a combine, you can click uh, start a combine and I'll take you to this page right here um, where you can select uh, which which account size that you want so um, you know it shows you that it's regularly 165 and right now you're getting it for $49 which is kind of like you know the discount or whatever I think that when tops of X comes out which we'll talk about in a second I think they're gonna do another discount so just be on the lookout for that but uh, you hit select here and then you can see all the platforms that they offer. So Topstep X is one of those platforms. Uh, it's not out just yet, but when it does come out, um, I think that they're gonna be running another special. I actually have Topstep X because I was a part of um, their whole process for getting Topstep X ready. So I have accounts, so I'm gonna do a review on Topstep X, uh, show you guys what I like, what I don't like. But Topstep X, when that comes out, will be one of their platforms you can choose. They've got Quan Tower, they've got Ninja, they've got Trade of Eight, and then they have their additional platforms. You know, they have Atlas, Sierra, uh, Jigsaw, I mean, Bookmap. They just have a whole bunch. So they pretty much have all the other, um, you know, normal accounts or the normal platforms that everybody else has. Um, but like I said, just be on the lookout for when types of X drops because I think that's when they may do another uh, big discount. This is one of my accounts that I have that's an eval account. Uh, and this is what you'll see once you actually purchase your account. It takes you to this dashboard that you get where you can track everything that you've been doing. And there's only really a few rules that Top Step has in place. The only way you can truly blow your account is if you go below your maximum uh, loss limit. So you get $2,000. So right now I can't go below uh, $50,000 because I'm above my trailing drawdown amount um but they also have this daily loss limit as well so on the daily loss limit you can't go below a thousand dollars or they will deactivate your account for that trading day so you don't actually blow your account but basically you can't blow your account in a day you can't lose two thousand dollars or the three thousand dollars or six thousand dollars you can't do it in a day you have a maximum amount of money during the day that they give you which on a 50k account is only a thousand dollars now the other thing the other rule that they have is that your best day can't be greater than 50 percent of your total profits right so currently in this account my best day was 95 percent uh of my total profit because i had a 1500 dollars day so because of this when i go to pass my account i have to make an additional 18 dollars, which isn't a big deal but it is what it is and then they tell you, or they, they keep track of your objective. So right now, um, uh, I've made $1,500. And so I need $1,500 more to make to pass the account. Um, currently, this account is at 51.5. Uh, I did have it as high as 52.2. Uh, but unfortunately, I had a losing day. I lost like $600 the other day. So it shows my worst day, which was $600. My average winning day, which is 458. And then my average losing day is about $400 as well. So 
just a little insights on the account. Also, I really like how TopSub has the dashboard. It shows you, it tracks all the days uh, that you've traded. So it's got this little line graph. It shows me, you know, how close I am to my minimum balance for the day, which is, you know, where my account will blow for the actual day. So you can see on this day, I was pretty close, but I didn't actually end up blowing it. I stopped. And then this will show you where your account will actually be blown. So right now, uh, to blow this account, I have to lose $1,500 pretty much and get that back down to the $50,000 uh, starting amount because of the trailing drawdown. It's an end of day trailing drawdown, not an intraday trailing drawdown. So that's another reason why I really like Top Step because it's uh, end of day, meaning that um, every trade won't hurt you if you end up giving back profit. Once you've hit your profit target on your trading combine and you pay the 150, they move you to the express funded account. Now, the thing about this, the express funded account is the rules are basically the same. Oh, and by the way, there are no news rules either. So you can trade during news uh, in the combines and in the express funded. So once you go ahead and pass the trading combine and you're in the express funded account, the rules stay exactly the same as far as how you blow the account. You just can't hit that maximum loss limit. And then on top of that, you'll have your daily loss limit, which will stop you from trading for the day, right? Um... And again, it says here, the daily loss limit on your account will not deactivate or it'll deactivate you for the trading day, but it won't kill you as far as your account. The best part about top step is the payout structure because the payout structure is super simple and is across all of the accounts, the 50K account, the 150K account and the 100K account. I don't know why I said it like that, but whatever, y'all got it. So it's just Five winning days of $200 or more. That's it. Five winning days. Does that have to be consecutive? Just five winning days of $200 or more. And you can pull out 50% of whatever you made. 50%. Oops. I swear I can't draw zeros. But 50% of whatever you made is yours. And you can go ahead and take that out. And then the remaining 50% stays in. That's it. There's no... um. There, there's no specific amount of money that you need to make. I mean, I guess there kind of is because the at the bare minimum, you need to have $1,000 in there. But they're not capping you on how much money you can make and take out. So if you're up, you know, $50,000 in a week or in five days, then you can take out 25K. No problem, right? So that's something that I really like. They're not making you jump through hurdles. They're not giving you any extra stipulations. It's just five winning days of $200 or more. Now, the one downside, the one major problem that I have with Top Step is the scaling plan. This is the only knock, the only huge knock that I have on Top Step, and I'm gonna explain why. So remember, earlier on, we were talking about the contract sizes for the accounts and how much contracts they allow you to trade. The problem is that all contracts for the sizes aren't created equal and they kind of mess you over with this a little bit. So on top step, on the 50K accounts, if you're below $1,500, they only allow you to trade two lots, right? In the combine, they'll let you trade five lots whenever you want. There's no scaling plan at all. But once you get into the funded account, now you can only trade two lots if you're below $1,500. The problem with this is that two minis and two micros, they're not the same, right? If you've been trading futures for a while, you know that two minis is much larger than two micros. And so therefore it can make it a little bit harder to grow your account because if you're used to only trading, let's say five micros, well, now there's no real in between between trading five micros and an entire mini. There's a big difference there. Then once you get above that 1500, now on a 50K account, they let you trade three lots until you're up to 200 or 2000. And then once you're above 2000, then you get your entire five lots back, right? And again, five lots aren't created equal when you're talking about mini to micros. Five micros is much smaller than five minis, right? The 100K account, same deal. They start you off with a little bit more. So when you're below uh, 1,500, you get three lots. 1,500 to 2,000, you get four. 
2,000 to 3,000, you get five. And then once you're above the 3K, you get your whole 10 lot size back. And then the 150K account, uh, once you're below, when you're below the 1,500, you get three. 1,500 to 2,000, you get four. 2,000 to 3,000, you get five. 3,000 to 4,500, you get 10. And then once you're above that 4,500, basically, once you're above your trailing drawdown threshold, they give you your entire lots back and you get 15 lots. Um, the only thing I will say is that when you're in the 100 and 150K, you get a little bit more breathing room. So trading like one mini, you 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 can more comfortably, depending on your trading style, right? This all depends on your trading style, but you can more comfortably trade that mini on the larger account size, in my opinion, than you can on the 50K account. Right. So that's this is really my only big knock on top step is and it, it's not really even the scaling plan itself. Like I'm cool with them having the scaling plan. I just think if they're going to do a scaling plan, then do a true one to one. Right. Where one mini you are allowed to trade 10 micros. Right. If you're in, if you're giving me two minis, I should be allowed to trade 20 micros because they're the same exact thing. Right. That way it gives people the flexibility. If they don't want to trade a whole mini, then they can go down and trade, you know, five, seven, whatever micros they want to trade. But it's still under the mini. If you're going to give me a mini, then give me the micros as well. So that's my only really big knock on top step. Other than that, like everything else is amazing for top step. But this is a huge not blow, but just it's it, in my opinion, it's a prop. Right. And this is something that I think they should really focus on addressing. And then once you've proven that you can trade, they actually have like this. uh this uh, risk manager that I guess looks at all the accounts and he's looking at people trading and you know what once once you basically have shown to top step that you are a good trader who can manage risk and you know do everything that a good trader should be doing they'll offer you a live funded account where pretty much they'll just take all the profits from your current account that you're in and they'll put into a live account and then you could trade live for them and pretty much the same things go uh five winning days of two hundred dollars or more um, and then you just can't hit your daily loss limit as well as your account balance just can't go below zero because now you're in an actual account. I heard there's some other stipulations there too. Like you can talk to them and they can remove your daily loss limit and just other things that um, you can kind of propose and they may or may not do. Um, the other thing too about the payouts is once you've gotten 30 days of $200 or more after that, you can withdraw whenever you want, as much as you want, as long as you have profits to withdraw in your account. And again, this by far just changes the game for me when it comes to Top Step because every other prop from out there, there's always a payout window that you have to you know abide by. The only other prop firm that doesn't have that is um, Take Profit. To my knowledge, I'm sure there's probably a few others, but at least for the big ones that people know, this is again a game changer because they're not trying to you know make you jump through hoops to get your profit out after you've shown the consistency for 30 winning days there's no cap on how much profit you can take and you can request it whenever you want so again just another leg up in my opinion for top step and then i wanted to talk about the profit split because the first ten thousand dollars is yours you receive a hundred percent and then after that ten thousand dollars they go to a 90-10 profit split, which you get 90 and they get 10. So really good profit split. Um, that's pretty much, again, industry standard. So good on them for following that. And then I like how they show how quickly you can actually get your payouts. Um, I know with some prop firms, they take a little bit longer than others. But with Wise, it's one to three business days. With ACH, it's one to three. Uh, a Wire or Swift is three to five. And then if you're international, it's about five to 10 business days. So uh, obviously sometimes it could be a little bit longer, but it's just nice to see how quickly you can actually get your payouts. You can have multiple funded accounts on top step. They allow you to have three express funded accounts at a time and then one live account at a time. So what they'll do is they'll basically offer one of your express funded accounts to become live. And then they'll take the earnings that you have in that account and they'll transfer it to a live account. And then they'll be trading with live funds. And then if you want every other express funded account that you have, if they offer you to make it live, then they'll take that one account and they'll put it into that one live account that you have. 
and then you'll have to restart another uh, combine account to get it back up to being express funded account. And that's kind of how they work out their express funded accounts with their live accounts. Now I have heard a rumor that they might be up in the amount of express funded accounts that you can have from three to 10. Just a rumor for now, but I've heard it. So I'll have my ear to the ground and be looking out for an announcement. And then as soon as I find out, then I'll let you guys know um, that that's happened. But yeah, just something to be aware of. TopStep is by far the best platform out in my opinion. You know, they're not perfect. They have a few things wrong, which I did highlight in this video. But overall, I feel like they are the best prop firm out and they are truly for the trader, not against us when it comes to prop firms. If you are interested in trying out a top step combine account and you want to support the channel, then there is a affiliate link down below that will take you to top step and it's at no extra cost to you. But we greatly appreciate the support. If you have any questions that you want answered about top step, leave them below in the comments. Please make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. And if you haven't already watched it, I have a video comparing top step to apex and you can catch it right over here.